Hi there, I would like to give you a brief introduction to technical parameters in industrial image processing with laser sensor technology. Some of the most important technical parameters in industrial image processing with laser sensor technology are laser resolution, accuracy, linearity, repeatability, and z-deviation. The resolution of a sensor is the smallest possible distinction between two measuring points. For a Qualtech 3D laser scanner, the measurement width in X divided by the number of pixels determines the X resolution. The Z resolution is calculated using the X resolution, the triangulation angle, the distance between the transmitter and receiver, and the shine fluke angle. The Z resolution is usually measured over many profiles and thus generates a standard distribution of the individual profiles. The mean value of the standard distribution represents the resolution in the Z direction. The resolution in the X direction, along the laser profile line, depends on the optics and the image chip. The resolution in the Z direction, the height of the profile point, depends on one hand on the X resolution and on the other hand on the surface roughness off the component to be measured. As a rule, it can be assumed that the rougher a surface is, the more noise it generates. This noise reduces the achievable resolution. As a rule of thumb when selecting a sensor, one can assume, the smallest detail still to be measured is about a factor of 5 larger than the respective resolution in X, Y, and Z. The accuracy is the calculated value between the measured and the true value. To determine this value, one takes a number of measurement profiles and calculates an average profile from them. Then the difference is calculated between the true value of the distance with the measured value over the profile. This also allows the linearity to be determined. The accuracy of a laser scanner depends on the high quality of the optics, the precise assembly of all optical components, and the quality of the calibration. This means that through high quality calibration, also a high accuracy of the sensor can be achieved. The precision says something about the scatter of the measured values. If the measured values are very close to each other, this is called high precision. Repeatability and precision are very similar terms. Both indicate how robust the measurement data is or whether it is subject to fluctuations. Since the laser line triangulators usually have no moving parts, high repeatability of the sensor can be expected. Nevertheless, high precision alone is not enough, because the values can still have poor accuracy even though they are close together. Therefore, in practice, it is important that precision and accuracy are good, then good measurement results can be achieved. However, the sensor almost always makes a movement by means of a precise axis over the measurement object, or the measurement object is moved under the laser sensor over a conveyor belt. Because of such movements, height errors can be picked up, which then reduces the repeatability. However, the influence of handling movements is often underestimated. For example, if a robot only achieves a positioning accuracy of 600 micrometers, a laser triangulation sensor can have an accuracy of 4 micrometers, which is then superimposed by robot positioning accuracy. Nevertheless, even under such conditions, sophisticated measurement strategies can still achieve high accuracies with this optical measurement method. From many measured profiles that are averaged, the deviation in the Z direction can be determined over the measuring range. This is an indication of the best focus range of the sensor, the working range in which the image of the optic is the sharpest. You can see that in the red rectangle, Z deviation is much less. Thanks for watching. If you have any further questions, please feel free to contact our machine vision specialist, Thomas Sturz and Hecker at PS at Qualtech.di. We look forward to exchanging experiences with you from the field. You can also check our YouTube channel for real projects by scanning the QR code in the upper right corner.